So much money, I'm rich, baby. Dude, look at all this money. Dude, they left so much money behind. The clown casino. Oh, 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 oh. What's up guys, I'm Osarji. Welcome back to another video. I'm joined with the boys. What's up, Aldo? Ooh, what's, what's up? Go? Angelo, and today we are doing, guys, we're exploring this abandoned casino resort. I did this one years ago on my own. I brought the boys to come with me today. Hell Look yeah, baby. Look at this. Who Ooh. gets to explore such beautiful places? Not us, you guys do. Yeah. Let's do this video. Exactly, you gotta watch the video from the beginning to the end. There is a mean security guard though in here, so we gotta be careful. You serious? We have to sneak around. We gotta suck I mean, pay him off. We're not sucking nobody off. Or pay him off. <laughs> we we don't have money. I don't make oh. any money. So we're, we're sucking him off. Do you have money? I have a wallet. Okay, we're nobody sucking anybody off There's tonight. Money in there. Guys, right guys, now. guys, keep it. Listen, these boys are fueled up right now on espresso. We just had salmon. We're about to go and explore this mega abandoned resort. Well, so here's the thing. I was in the casino, and then all of a sudden, these two random guys with forklifts come out of a building with forklifts? a forklift, so and they had pallets that so look like drugs. Yeah. They actually had pallets that looked like drugs on them. They were definitely trying to hide something. Maybe. Okay. Maybe that's why there's security here. I don't know. Smash the like button. Let's go and explore this resort. What the hell? I found a fishing rope. Oh, Woo! I found a big fishing pole. You want to go fishing? I it to a... <laughs> oh, wow. Well, we're about to enter the property of the abandoned resort. I don't see any security guards over there. I am filming on a GoPro today because it's much lighter for me if I needed to run away from security guards. Even if I have to like jump in the water and swim away, I could do that. That's why I brought a GoPro in case I had to jump in the water and swim away from security. Oh, I'm sorry to interrupt you. You look handsomely with the water right now. Oh man. I look handsome with the water? Yeah, look at the water. No hat, most Sarge with the water. I don't know if it's you or, hold on a second, actually, I think it's just the water, get out of the way. There we go. <laughs> oh man, this view is so. Dude, can you believe this is the beach of an abandoned resort right now? I can't believe it. This is basically what people would lie on and tan all day when they came and paid to go to this resort. This is where I would imagine to discover a mermaid, if mermaids were real. Your future wife? Yes. Hey mermaid, you gotta do the mermaid call. <laughs> Ariel! <laughs> Make out. I mean, find love, Ariel. Yeah, she's not here. Smash like button, y'all. All right, fam, we're actually on the abandoned resort property right now. I still don't see a security guard. Usually they wear shirts that have like red and yellow. Oh, look. What's that? Bones. What? There's really bones. Oh, what the hell? Damn, I start filming. Bro, these bones are like clean. Yeah, so it's fresh. Fresh bones. I wonder what animal got destroyed here. Now I found tarantulas here. I found big snakes out here, but there's a lot of buildings that I never got to explore. Like all the buildings on the left side, like that red roof that you guys are seeing all the way down there. I've never explored that. I've only done like these kind of like boring, you know, empty ones, which I don't think I'll do this time. And I've done the casino. But there's also a medical center. There's a theater. There's also the, uh, the main lobby. This was the gym here. Hey, look, does this remind you of anything? <laughs> <laughs> Mo's got a boner. <laughs> yeah, this used to be the gym. Oh yeah. Um, not real. That bone you planted it. Yeah, listen. Um, keep in mind, there's Haitians living in those houses over there. Yeah. So there's illegal Haitians living in those houses illegally down there. Those were actually like the luxury houses of this resort. Really? Yeah. But here's the thing. I actually went into one of those houses accidentally, and all the gym equipment were moved into there. Oh really? So I wonder if we can actually film it. As you guys can see, this used to be the gym. Oh look, they still have some, some weights here. I wonder if this was part of their actual... Oh yeah, these are, oh, these are weights. The fact that the mirrors are still here is absolutely unreal. These were the rules for the gym here. 7 a.m. to 9 p.m. Oh, it's still there. Hey, look at that building there. That house, it looks like all the furniture has been put into that one house. Now, I don't know if there's anyone living in there. I've never explored that side. Only I mean, like, we could go to it at some point. Yeah, we can, take a look. we can check it out. You and I have obviously been in these empty buildings. Yeah. I'm going to avoid those. I'm not yeah. going to go back in those. I just want to show that one room and that's yeah. pretty much it. But down that way, there's the casino. Yeah. When I was here about a year and a half ago, every machine was here. That's like crazy. the slot machines, the yeah. roulette machines, everything. I filmed it by myself. It was super dark in there. I didn't even have a light. I brought a light with me this time. And it got scary because I, I ran out. But there are buildings that I've never explored. Well, we're gonna try and do as many of them as we can. Yeah. Oh, oh, that's so creepy. All right, this is one of those old school abandoned most Sarge explorations that you guys love. So please guys, do me this big solid favor and subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, definitely hit that subscribe button. Look at this old baby chair over here. Overgrown. Oh, let's clean it up a little bit. <laughs> it's amazing how like 
nature overtakes everything. So I'm gonna risk it all by going to explore some of these buildings. Jeez, I thought I was a, a person that lives here. Just so I can see, oh, there's chickens there, then that means there's people living here, okay? Gotta be careful. Hey, there's chickens over there, so some of those houses might be inhabited. There's a person over there. Oh, there's a person over there, yeah, it's probably the security guard. Probably. All right, so if anybody talks to us, we're just gonna be like, we're just scientists serving the land. Okay. Yeah, right, pretty cool. So we're just documenting. Right. Yeah. Know. We're gonna go that way, and that way, and that way. Hey, there's a guy back there, let's head over there. Really? Yeah. All right, so the one guy living in that house, seen us and then he went back in his house it's not really his house but they're here illegally i don't know if he's going to tell the security that are at the gates there's always security guards at the front gates like that looks like a gift shop area over there see that house down that way and like the main lobby for the actual resort yeah all that stuff i've never filmed so who put these fences here? i have no idea yeah, like this place has been abandoned for like 20 years. Yeah, I wonder why it got abandoned. It's such a beautiful place. So oh, here, look. Restaurant, restaurant. Mango's, Mango's restaurant. Damn it, I wanted to eat at Mango Restaurant. <laughs> well, it's no longer open. <laughs> there we go. Angelo can climb the tree and take it for us. So word is, the owners of this place were fighting with each other what they wanted to do. One person wanted to refix this up. Like there's a bunch of owners that own it. Yeah. They want to fix it up and turn it into a resort again. The other guy didn't want to do that. He wanted to do like condos and they had fights with each other and one of them stabbed the other guy and he killed that one guy. Whoa, so, talk about getting uh, a little crazy. Yeah, so that's why it just sat abandoned and now it's falling apart. I can't believe after all these years, this bedroom is still here and mint condition. Now, me and Angelo discovered this resort in 2020. That's when I bought my house out here in the Dominican Republic. And literally, I, I live like five minutes away, which is crazy. We just walk a path through the jungle behind my house and we end up here. And when we discovered this back in 2020, this room was completely intact and it's still intact, but no way to get into it. Yo, check this out. What is this? A, oh, a bedroom. Wow, everything is left in condition. Just this one bedroom. You no, know, suddenly I'm feeling kind of tired. I kind of want to take a nap. If you can get in, go for it, dude. <laughs> it probably smells moldy in there. I know I said I was I wasn't gonna come in here, and this is a long shot, but let's see if that room is open to get into. Let's make sure nobody's here. Service, <laughs> emergency. Nah, it's, yeah, ain't no way. Someone's tried. Something is inside there, maybe. Completely locked, hello? Anyone in there? We are room, uh, room service. Room service. Housekeeping. You got a swipe card? Housekeeping. <laughs> Housekeeping. It's the only room in yeah, this resort entire resort, resort that looks like this. It makes no sense. Well, there's one way to get in there. You know what I mean? We can break it. Yeah. But there's no point. Like, we already saw it from the outside, you know? Yeah. It just would have been nice to jump on the bed a little bit. Yeah. And I would never break something like that anyway. Yeah, yeah, I would never break it. Door open. <laughs> if it's already open, we'll go in. If it's not, we'll find a way to get in. Damn, look at this view, though. Whoa. Woo! That is pretty. All right, now we're getting into areas where we really got to be careful because I had to run out of here last time because of security. Security, get out of here. Oh, dude, this house overgrew, so this was the- Oh, I almost didn't even see that. Yeah, when I was here last, this was not like this. So this was the kids' center. I think there's toys in there. Oh, really? Yeah, let's go check it out. There's a walkway over here. All right, so right now we're going to explore the kids' playground. So back when this was an active resort, they used to put the kids in here, I guess. The parents, I, I think so. Maybe I'm wrong, maybe it's not the kids center. Yeah, no, this is definitely not the kids center. No? No, it's, it was down that way, I think. Oh, there it is, sorry, there it is. That, that's it there. Oh, okay. The colorful picket fences. Yeah, this looks like it might have just been like storage or something. Yeah, it's cool though. Yeah. Yeah, this was the power station. Whoa, so creepy. Everything's rotted through. There's just something so freaking creepy about a kid's center that's abandoned. Right there. This was the daycare area where the parents would leave their kids. So creepy, There's something creepy about like a place structure like this, right? Yeah, this that's is very creepy. Overgrown falling apart. It looks like all the furniture is still inside. It's completely locked. No, it's locked. Everything's inside of it though, but it's locked. Oh, they like closed it off with cinder blocks for some reason. Yeah. Maybe the door was like opening and closing from the wind. Or the hiding something in there. Yeah, possibly. Oh, they should have stick our camera through here. There we go. Oh, uh, this is what it looks like inside. 
Anything in there? Some office desks and stuff. Not much. Uh, a lot of wasps over here. There's hives everywhere. Yeah. Oh, cool. Look at the seashells. Mm -hmm. Look at all this. Oh, yeah, that is cool. The wall of seashells. Although I was here a few years ago, I do want to go back to the casino and see if all the casino machines are still there. Now, you guys remember when I was there, I was there for like two minutes. I was panicking because there was people coming in and out of the other building, moving stuff that looked like drugs to me. I thought maybe it was like a cartel thing. Could be, I don't know. But I want to go back to the casino and see if the machines are still there. From there, we're going to move on to other parts of the resort to explore because there's other buildings that I never went into. Restaurants, lobby areas, the fun centers, all that stuff. All right, this is going to be a risky move because I see a car over there right over there i know you guys can't see it because i'm filming on a gopro but it's there there's a car it's just sitting there i've never filmed any of these buildings over here so all this is new to me the casino is down that way but i really want to see what's in these buildings they're massive there could be something in there they might be just empty but they actually look cleaner than all the other buildings and uh one of them actually has like grass cut so why have they cut the grass there i don't know but we're gonna find out i guess maybe they're using them Jeez, this thing is massive all right there is a car there, so we gotta be careful. See that car? Yeah. That wasn't there before. Oh, maybe they just moved it there. It could be like a decoy car. So yeah, we're gonna go up to the roof and get a better vantage point and see if we can spot security or anything like that. That building is mega big. It's crazy how the last time that I was here, I didn't notice any of these buildings. There's wasps everywhere, so be careful. Oh yeah. Oh my God, there's like wasp hives everywhere. The ceilings are just oh, wasps. Yeah, look at that. Look at this beehive over here. I don't think I've ever seen that before. Well, as long as we don't bother them, oh, there's one going to your camera. As long as you don't hit one of them. These types of wasps, like I've noticed, are kind of like friendly. Yeah. Like I've I've actually held a couple of them by hand. <laughs> but as long as you don't bother them, I think we'll be okay. Ooh, this whole place is full of wasps. Wow. Think we got to pay the wasp tax? Yeah. Dude, this is giving me like abandoned hospital vibes. Yeah, a wasp leg. Definitely abandoned hospital vibes in here. Yeah, you realize it's like a resort. How do we get upstairs? Through all the wasps. God damn it. There's so many. All along the whole railing over there. I ain't going over there. Dude, look at these wasps. They're just sitting there. Are there somebody yelling? The whole building is infested with wasps. Yeah, there's so many wasps. Even but, I went close to that little like daycare looking thing yeah. and there's wasps. Oh, that everywhere. was nothing. Trust me. Oh. Go check out what's in here. Dude, oh, yeah. We walked right through them. They didn't bother us. Oh my God, they're everywhere. Yeah, Dude, they're the literally other side is even worse. so they're many. Whoa, they're everywhere. Yeah. I don't know if I want to go there. Let's go to the other building. It looked a little bit cleaner. So we decided to skip this building because it's just full of bees. Every inch of it has bees in it. We're going to go to that one. It looks a little bit cleaner maybe. All right. I'm on edge, you guys. I just feel like I'm being watched. Like there's a car right there. That car was not there before. Yeah, that way is blocked. Yeah, I can see this building. Might have some bees inside of it as well. All right, looks like this is the way in. Damn, full of bees too. Alright, I made it into this building. Never been into these ones. The guys are, I don't know where the guys are. There's definitely less bees in this one, but there's, oh, never mind. There's like a sh ton. Holy sh, there's bees everywhere. Oh boy. God damn it. That's the problem with exploring out here. You just gotta be careful for the bees. They get you. Leave me alone, stupid beast. We're gonna check out this car that's here. Dude, notice how the grass is cut here? Oh, it is. It's like cleaned. Well, I see a couple ducks. Where there's ducks, there's people. Because people take care of the ducks. Really? Yeah, the ducks want to survive on their own out here. They usually belong to somebody. You sound like a four-man duck owner. Um, I've quacked around a lot. <laughs> Look at this car. This wasn't here before. What the hell? Damn. Hey, look. The other side's kind of open. You can stick your hand in. <laughs> I don't want to do that. Hey, just carefully don't get spotted, okay? 
The security guy should be just around that bend. Oh, look, so this car was operational back in 2018. Nice. That's their stickers. It's just a mess now. Yeah. Is there a dead body in the trunk? Uh, I don't know. You want to find out? Yeah, there's nothing. Let's go down this way because when I was here last, there were people over there with forklifts. And none of this, the scaffolding was not here. Hmm. The security station is just up there. Oh, that's crazy. Everything's left inside of these. Furniture? Yeah. Furniture. I don't know what's in there. Dude, there's like food products. It's mint in there. So I think a lot of these ones were like shops. See, this was the medical building. Oh, yeah. See, it's open. Dude. Oh what happened? What happened? Some wasp went like right to my face. Jeez. <laughs> and then as I was running, another one attacked me. Yo, oh. let's be extra cautious here and quiet. Because yeah, this looks too su suspicious. Yeah, Look at this here. Looks like everything's locked up. Look at this. I got Dude, jump scared. Look how clean the ha hallway is. Oh, yeah. Like, this does not look abandoned. Just a creepy looking hallway. Oh, God, the lizard. You guys see that door? Whoa. Oh, that's cool. This is like the office. All the blueprints are in there. The office, huh? Yeah. Well, have you ever been sent to the office? Yeah, many times. I got expelled from a couple of high schools in my past. <laughs> that was open last time. Careful. They're all locked. This is so creepy. This is so creepy. Yo, Yo, this is the place for you. Why? This right here. Dumbass? Dumbass. Hey, that's not nice. <laughs> Screw you. Dude, all these were open last time I was here. No, the doors were open? Yeah, you could go into them. I literally opened them. There's a lot of like, electric wires, too. Yeah, I'm still on edge. Yeah. Okay, so we're at the gift shop area now. There's a bunch of chickens running around. A lot of gardening equipment in here. That means they're actually maintaining this place. So they are maintaining it. All their garden equipment is inside here. Oh, really? This is the casino, by the way. Maybe they're rebuilt. I don't know. This doesn't look like it's being rebuilt. It just looks like it's just sitting here. Oh, yeah. This is how we get into the casino. All right. Yes. The machines are still here. Yeah. Yes. Oh. <laughs> this is awesome. The machines are still here. This is so yes. cool. I really thought they would have gotten rid of them. Yeah. Wow. They've taken a lot of them out though. Yeah. There was a lot more machines. I wonder what this casino was called. Maybe the palms? <laughs> this is cool, man. I feel like I'm back in Vegas. Oh, all the roulette tables are still there. Actually, you know what? I think the machines are still the way they were. I just thought there was more because all the machines are back there, too. Yeah. Oh, security, security. Look, chicken security. <laughs> There's a chicken just walking around. Get out of here, chicken. You heard a footstep? Something. There's a little thing. Outside in the front, yeah. I don't think I ever went in here. Oh, these are just like the bathroom areas. Men's, women's. These are cool shaped bathrooms. It was like coffin shaped. So the last time I was here, as you guys remember, I didn't have a light on me and it was extra dark for me to film this. Dude, these roulette tables. Casino Carnival is what it was called. The Clown Casino. Ooh, look at the roulette machine here. Does it still spin? Nope, definitely not. Whoa, all the chairs. Excuse me, sir, I just won a lot of money. Can I cash out, please? Um, I'll take a million dollars in cash. First, you must swipe 
ATM. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <laughs> this was where they probably got their money. Like they come yeah, here. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, see, it says there's a thing here with exchange rates. US 35, Canada 30, Euro 47. Wow. I wonder if there's any indication on when this became. Are these eggs? Yo, the chickens, a chicken's laid some eggs here. These are fresh eggs. Well, that's awesome. <laughs> that must be that chicken that's outside. Probably. Did you see it? Yeah, it was trying to come back in. Oh. Those are its eggs right there. Yeah, I remember when I was here last, I was really scared, so I filmed it really quickly. Not as scared this time, but wow, look at this. All the machines are still here in this casino. So this was the poker area over here. Yeah. yeah. All right, step right up, step right up. <laughs> out of service, oh man. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. It's out of service, apparently. <laughs> they had all these uh, other machines too. Uh, yeah, I don't think they took anything out. It was all slots here. Yeah, looks like pretty much everything's still here. This had to have been like from the 70s. Could be. Right? Like these look like machines from the 70s, in my opinion. I wish there was a way of knowing. But if you guys know anything about machines and gambling, I don't know nothing about gambling. Oh wait, there might be a, a, a date on this one. Yeah, these, these machines were probably even from like the 60s, who knows? This one was service last in 07. Oh wow, okay. <laughs> that was what, uh, 16, 17 oh, years ago. This machine was made in 19... What was that? <laughs> this machine was made in 1996. Okay. Yeah, the serial code is right here. 1996, seems older than that. Right? No, yeah, definitely 1996. Yeah, I actually found money. Yo, you go, rich, look at this. I'm keeping this. Dinner's on Mo. My lucky five pesos. So here's the thing. We're inside like the bank area over here and all this stuff is still inside. So this is what this place was called. It's called Corral Sol de Plata. Resort, spa, and casino. Blackjack, roulette, match play field. This is cool. Like all the information that I've been looking for is actually right here on this. The most beautiful casinos, security, and best service of the North Coast. Okay. Doesn't look that beautiful, but you know, whatever, if you say so. What the hell is that? What is that? Is that a chicken? Sounds like somebody's eating it. They're calling this gooey Sounds like someone's deep frying that chicken. <laughs> That's the sound of the chicken snitching. Hey, you know what these were for? For all the money. Are they? Oh yeah, when you win the money? Yeah. That's so cool. Jackpot. All right, so I don't think I ever managed to go into any of these rooms. Uh, what was in here? Yeah, it looks kind of, whoa, a security box. Nothing in it. Old ketchup jar over there. <laughs> Look at that old ketchup jar. That's wild. This is why it's good to come back to a place you've been to years ago. Because there's a lot of stuff that you miss, you know. This is an abandoned casino with money left behind. I know, I found a whole bucket of it behind a back A bucket there. of it? Yeah, look at what I found. These are real pesos, I think, no? Oh, just a feel it or sucker. <laughs> Oh really? I want one. Yeah, I where, where is it? Where is it? There's a vault back there. No way. Yeah, the whole vault, there's like clean cards. I missed all of this the last time. Yeah. What? Yeah, see I didn't go to, into any of these areas the last time I was here. Oh, somebody sharded all over the walls here. This is the room they would take you in when you steal money and they beat the shit out of you. <laughs> right in here. Like the jail cell? This is it right here. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, dude, look at all this money. Dude, they left so much money behind. What? You see it? Oh. oh, look at all the money. We're rich. I'm gonna walk out with money in my pocket. Hell yeah. <laughs> no, I'm just joking. We're rich. I don't want it. Yo, look at this. I just found a 1,000 poker chip. Wow. 1,000 poker chips. So we are finding money in here. This is cool. Dude, this is literally an abandoned casino with money left behind. Literally money. Woo! All right, let's see what else. There oh, there's this. That's the safe. Bro, I didn't see this the last time I was here. Yeah, it's really cool. Right? That's how scared I was. Oh, it's so heavy. This is the actual safe. See, I didn't see any of this the last time I was here. And there's money inside. Whoa, another cave. Something flying around inside? Yeah. What is it? Whoa. Oh my God, look at all these poker chips. That is so cool. Just bags and bags. Oh, the dealer chip. Guys, don't do gambling. It's obviously bad for you. Oh, wow. This is interesting. See, this is not something I expected to find in an abandoned casino. All their poker chips are still here. Let me turn down my light a little bit. You guys can see it better. But yeah, guys, all their poker chips are here. What is this? Wow, this is crazy. 
So much money, I'm rich, baby. <laughs> smells like there were chickens living in here too. The wild, wild things. This is a cool adventure. Look at this box. Yeah, these are all just empty. It is really cool that I got a chance to come back here again. I've been wanting to. I've been here for almost three months now. And this is literally in my backyard. Literally. <laughs> and I never decided to come back until now. I wish I came back sooner so you guys would have had this adventure sooner. But this is a treat. It really is. Yeah, so there's another room here that I've never been to. And it's this one. Oh, something's moving on here. Oh, I just saw a rat jump across. What? Must explain all the rat poop. I got attacked by a bat. Holy sh**. Whoa, that thing came right for me. I thought it was a rat. I seen a rat like jumping in the ceiling. I'm like, oh, it's just a rat. And then it comes out of there. It's a freaking bat. It flies? Yeah. You found a flying rat? Yeah, it's a bat. Basically, bats are flying rats. <laughs> it's in there. It's a flying rat. Jeez, that scared the crap out of me. And there was a big rooster just waiting for me around the corner. Look at this. Come here. Give me a big cock. There's chickens everywhere though, so that means there, there must be the owner somewhere nearby. Right? We're hearing talking coming from over there. That's some guy can sell their shotgun. No. Well, they're, they're, they can't do it. You shoot us. We're not doing anything. Yeah, they can do anything, bro. There's no rules. I didn't inside. see no trespassing. Did you? <laughs> yeah, there's no signs yeah. in. You can't be here. Areas that I've never been to before. Mm -hmm. Yeah, give them some casino chips. I do hear somebody talking that way, so at this point, we don't care if anybody shows up. This was the main lobby. That is so cool. Wow. Yeah, see, I never made it out here last time. I hear a lot of chickens. Oh, these are the machines for the, the restaurant. The dough mixers. They got Wi-Fi here. <laughs> Yeah, this is sketchy. If it's one thing I've learned out here in the Dominican Republic, if there's a chair like this, yeah. there's always some guy that's supposed to like manage that. Also, there's also a pair of shoes behind you. Yeah. I wonder where that ladder goes. But there's a giant walk. Wait, are there chickens in here? Oh, they are. There's chickens in here. What the? This is someone's chicken coop. <laughs> Damn it. We gotta be careful. Oh, I hear police sirens. Hold on, let's just make Is it for us? There's a road over there. The security is just up down that way. Yo, do you think they got us? Is it coming for us? Well, we'll find out in two seconds. It's going to turn in if it does come. Sounds like it's getting closer. Yeah, I think the police actually is coming for us. Oh, it kept going. Yeah, it's gone. Holy sh**. That was close. We would have just run to the beach. All right, well, these are areas that I haven't explored before. I'm going to take a look at this car. This was probably used here in the resort to haul stuff around, just like any other resorts that you guys go to, if you've ever been to one. <laughs> Holy sh**. It's definitely seen better days. Oh, my God. Wow. This thing is so cool. <laughs> what the heck? I love it. I think we found a way in. Bats everywhere. What was that? Bats. <laughs> oh yeah. I think so. Ah, clickbait. It comes back out to the lobby. Uh, this is where you would get your room keys from. Oh, there's a whole safe here. A safe. Money safe. And... <gasps> I will cut you down like the <laughs> cockroach that you are. What <laughs> the hell is that doing here? <laughs> it's a machete. Damn. I know what it is, but... <laughs> I will cut you down. What the heck is that? <laughs> Machete. Whoa. It's cool. Alright, that is cool. I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave it here so somebody can kill somebody with it. it no, I'm just so out of here. It's not, it's not that bad. 
Yeah. Yeah, a little bit of mold that it hurt nobody. Yeah, actually. So there's no way into the restaurant from here. That's what we're trying to do right now, guys. We're trying to find the restaurant. Uh, I have a case in a really big amount, so that's oh. okay. Somebody's locked these doors. Yeah. What well, Seems a bit creepy, guys. That's pretty weird. What the hell? It's like a trap. They've put, like, ropes on the doors. I think it's a trap. If you open it, you're going to get smacked in the head by something. Wow, what's in there? There's a crowbar. There's nothing in there, though. Yeah, there's literally nothing there. Alright, unlock it. Uh oh. Dude, there's probably something crazy in there. Oh, there's a chicken in there. There's one? Yeah, one chicken. Guys, guys, somebody's here. No way. Where? Let's let's go out. Come this way. It could be some of the Haitians going back to their actual houses. What was he wearing? It's hard to tell. Maybe we should get out of here. There's still more to explore, though. Yeah. Yeah, we recently did a video. I don't know if you guys saw it or not. We're in an abandoned resort, and then a security guard came at me with a shotgun. Almost shot me. Kicked us out, obviously, but could have been worse. Yeah, what we do is really freaking dangerous. Just, just kind of hand me how dangerous it is. <laughs> yeah. But that's why they come and watch us, because we're actually a lot of fun. We're entertaining. Nobody wants to watch fast-paced YouTube videos anymore. People want to watch an adventure. They want to watch a thrill. I hear a car. I really wish I had eyes on that motorcycle. So this resort is actually bigger than I freaking thought. Like, there's so many more buildings that I never even got a chance to look at. We're trying to find a way into the restaurant, and they were all locked from the front. The way the guests get in. Hello? Oh, this is creepy. This is crazy. We just found a room to where all the records for this resort was. This is crazy. <laughs> I've never seen anything like this. What the hell? What? This is why you go above and beyond. This is why I don't just want to leave. There's more that we haven't found. Like, and I guarantee it's going to be epic. Imagine like the government shows up one day, it's like, hey, can I see your files for this year? Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, see, si, senor. Let me just get this from oh, what year? <laughs> what year? Oh, $40,000? Man, these guys are making a lot of money. Yeah. yeah, that should be my account. Jeez. Oh, they got staples here? Bro, these guys were actually on point with their bookkeeping. <laughs> 2005? What? That's crazy. Oh, more bookkeeping stuff. These are like the behind the scenes back areas of the restaurants. Oh, there's another vehicle that's abandoned. That is so creepy. I am so happy that I came back. This is awesome. I hear somebody talking. This looks terrifying. Let's go in. All right, 
right, so there's nothing in here clearly. I don't see any other people here, which is good. I feel like I'm in like the favela or something here. What? Oh, dude, it's a jail. What? It's an actual jail cell. I wonder if this was an actual jail cell. and stuff. So what the hell was this? An actual jail cell or what? I wonder if that jail cell looking thing is where they would put like the expensive alcohol. <laughs> Dude. To be honest, I didn't expect any of this coming here today. This is where they did all the dishwashing. It's like a maze though. There's gotta be a way to get to the restaurant from here. See what's up these creepy staircases. Looks like somebody's kicked this door open. Yeah, definitely somebody was living here. Someone was living up there, but there's nothing there. No, it's not worth going up. It's an empty room, just with like a tarp on the ground. Well, I gotta say, you look like a queen coming down these stairs. A what? Like a queen. A queen? <laughs> take a quick look and see what's down this way and then we're gonna move on to another building there's so much here oh dude this keeps going man this place is still going like there's another vehicle here all right we're gonna go up these stairs and see what's up here get a better vantage point it's getting so hot out these are just bathrooms. Damn, that one's locked. Oh, look, papayas. What? You want a free papaya? Bro, you know what? I have a controversial opinion about papayas. What? They actually just taste like, like puke? puke. Yeah, yeah. bro, I <laughs> find it. <laughs> they taste like puke. Yeah, when you puke in your mouth and you swallow, that's what it tastes like. And people like it for some reason. It's I think so it's weird. disgusting. They actually so, taste so bad. I thought I was the one person who had that. Damn, no. we said it at the same time. But you know what's funny? Some people don't taste that. Really? Some people taste sweetness for some reason. I have a papaya tree in my backyard. Yeah. And I picked one one time and I ate it and it tastes like puke. Literally tastes Disgusting. so bad. Disgusting. Hey, Angelo, yeah. do you think papaya tastes like puke? I don't know. Because it's controversial, but some people, when they eat papaya, it tastes like puke. Yeah. Some people taste amazing. For me, it tastes like puke when I eat it. <laughs> yo, 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 there's a guy outside. He saw Angelo. Is he good? Yeah, I think so. Is this security? I don't know what he's saying. Is he still here? Yeah, he's right there. He's on the say, say you're taking a photo. Oh, we're taking a photo. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Let's walk around to the right and just get the f out of here. Yeah, I, mean, that's I don't think he's security. No, no, he's probably one of the Haitians that lives out yeah. back. Is he here? Oh, there was a guy right there. Oh, he's gone. Okay, good. Guys, this is the part of the video where Angelo starts hallucinating. I want to actually see this guy. Bro, I heard his voice. Really? I mean, I turned my camera to Yeah, maybe we should get out of here before more of Dude, it's funny because I just walked to this road and there was nobody here. Don't forget, even though in our brain we're friendly Canadian. Oh yeah, there he is. Uh, yeah, he's one of the Haitians that lives here. So there's abandoned houses down there and the Haitians live in them. Okay, let's get the hell out of here. No, I think we're okay. Yeah, I think we're good. Right there's more built, dude. As soon as, as, soon as I said uh, I'm taking a photo, yeah. said, oh, okay. When you say you're taking a photo, yeah. they don't give a shit. Just don't say you're taking a video, because then they'll have a problem. Yeah. No. They don't know what video means. They just know photo. Technically a video is just a collection. I think I just found some lunch. What is this? Oh, <gasps> it's a guava. Mmm. Mmm. Yo. These are yummy. I just found fruits. Yo, where were you? I'm stocking up. Oh my god. 
Do you guys want to eat? I'm actually hungry. Have one. No. It's a guava. I don't know. You never had a guava? Dude, they're delicious. Angel, have a guava. I don't Are you guys actually you scared to have a f***ing guava? Yes. Dude, try it. Stop being a pussy. Be a man. Know. Do the right thing. I don't like it that much. Dude, guavas are delicious. Really? Mmm. Oh, is there... You guys, I don't know why, but for some reason my stomach hurts. Bro, guavas are yummy. Alright, buddy. Yeah, the ones I got here, most of them tell me stomach hurts. Mm. No, nah, bro, here. You gotta try this. No, I'm good. Just eat it. Seriously, I don't want Bro, it. it's so healthy for you. It's full of vitamins and Just nutrition. Just eat it. Mm. I don't even like guavas. Dude, they're delicious. That's some of the best guavas I've ever had, to be honest. All right. Aldo, are you gonna do it or what? You gonna do it? Fine, I guess. Brand new one. Eat the whole thing. Peer pressure. It's so good. Yeah, peer pressure. You're gonna love it. It's the one bad one. <laughs> Yo. No way. No oh, way. Gosh. It's not bro. bad. No. Bro, these are delicious. The ones that I had were super sweet. Oh, I'm picking all these. Really? I, I think these are amazing. Man, y'all don't know what's up. Mm. Mm. Yo, God. I think it might be a little restaurant or something, but check it out. There's all these mansions. These are all abandoned, but they're a bit sketchy to go check them out because some of them have Haitians living in them. We could peek in the window of like this one. Yeah. This had to have been like a restaurant, like a little outdoor lunch restaurant. Let's take a look at it quickly. Oh, that's so cool. It looks like the walls are like crooked. Oh, dude, look at this diner. That's awesome. What? Now, this is something unique. I've never seen this. Look at the walls. <laughs> that's so pretty. This is like an ice cream shop, I think. I found the ice cream shop. Really? I'm pretty sure this was an ice cream shop. This is cool. Ice cream, fries cream. <laughs> this is probably like a cafe. Ice cream. Ice cream. Yeah, yeah. And then whatever else they had. Where's right? the ice cream? So the other one was an ice cream shop, but this one might have been just a normal restaurant or, or something or a store. Yeah. Probably some that one shops. I think was a, a little restaurant. Over here. Probably a coffee shop. I'm sure there was like tables here. People would sit here and eat something. Yeah, because you can tell some of the, uh, the lights that there's probably those tables in there. There's mm. also a lot of wasps in the corner. Oh yeah, lots of wasps. Into your left. <laughs> I think that's it for this resort, you guys. All right, so these are all the abandoned houses here where the Haitians live. They live in the smaller ones over there. More hidden from the cops if the cops show up. No one here? Closed. I mean, you would see, you would know right away. Yeah, really small though. It's very deceiving. Yeah, these are like, more, but these are like more like luxury yeah. rentals on the beach. These would have been like quad fellas. Jesus Christ! <laughs> Slams the door on me. Yeah, they're pretty much empty. Yeah. I'm just kind of worried. If you see laundry, then there's gonna be Haitians. Where's the laundry? I did see it earlier on some of the other houses, closer to the beach. Well, this one's a lot bigger. Oh, this one has its own kitchen. Has a kitchen? Yeah. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, there's two floors here. Check it out. Yeah. What we found inside is absolutely crazy. Watch the extended cut on the Mosarji app. Just download the Mosarji app and become an exclusive member where you can watch so much more content I don't post on YouTube. Links to the app in the description below. Thank you, my friend.